To begin working with Instapage, log into your account using your email and password or click Log in with Google if you'd like to use your Google credentials. This is what your dashboard looks like. It contains a summary of your recent activity and performance and features three sections, quick actions, quick reporting, and last worked on. Let's proceed to create a new landing page. You can create a new page from scratch or upload an Instapage file of a page that you previously downloaded. Let's choose the first option. In the new window, start with a blank page or choose one of our pre-made layouts. Name your page and proceed to the Instapage Builder. Use the Builder to modify objects on your page, edit text, color, alignment, and more. Use the Instablocks library to add new blocks to your page. Rearrange the blocks. Use the toolbar on the left to add more elements to your page, such as text boxes, images, videos, and so on. Click the toggle button on the upper left to switch between the desktop and the mobile editor and use it to make edits to your page's mobile version. Click the Save button to save the changes you've made. Now, let's see how you can create a blank landing page and customize it with Instablocks. Select the blank page layout, name your page, and click Edit Design to proceed with the Instapage Builder. Use the toolbar on the left to add all the necessary blocks to your blank page, such as headers, features and benefits sections, lead generators, and calls to action. Remember to switch to the mobile editor to check if your page is mobile friendly. If you'd like to revert to an old design that you may have liked better, click the version history button to view previously saved versions of your landing page. Here are the steps to publish your landing page. Click publish page on the dashboard and choose one of the following options. You can publish your page through a custom domain, WordPress, Drupal, or simply publish it via a subdomain for testing purposes. For now, let's proceed with the last option. Enter your subdomain in the text field and click Publish. Then, click Confirm to publish your page. Once it goes live, you can use the same menu to edit the URL or unpublish your page at any moment. That's it for today. Check out our other video tutorials and visit instapage.com to get your 14-day free trial.